Hello, William. Good evening. Do you listen to me, William? Good evening, teacher. Okay, great. Excellent. So today you didn't have any problem uh, with the platform, with Zoom? Hoy no tuvo problema para ingresar? No, no. Es ah, que okay. está, 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 está sencillo. Es a ver por qué los demás les cuesta. Sí, ¿verdad? Bueno, mm -hmm. vamos a esperar porque no... Hoy lo único que pasa es de que como uno registra un correo, ¿verdad? Sí. Antes uno solo lo ignoraba el correo que caía de la nueva sesión y, y ya estaba adentro. Mm. Hoy como que por obligación le pide que abra el correo y entre por medio del correo. Quizá es por mayor seguridad. Ah, para validar que el correo que puso en el registro es el... Es el suyo. Ajá. Ah, ok. Muy bien. Bueno, quizás por eso es que a algunos les está costando ingresar en este momento, ¿verdad? ¿Y cómo estuvo su sí. día, William? Ahí más o menos. Mañana hay reunión de reunión operativa. ¿Oh, sí? sí. Uh, but is it going to be in the morning, in the afternoon, or in the evening? En la mañana de, de 8 in the morning, ¿eh? Mm -hmm. the, the eight. From, from eight to from eight, 11. From eight to 11, uh, okay. Uh, to 11. Excellent, very well. So good luck for that meeting, okay. That is an ongoing event that is going to take place these days for you, yes. Es un evento ya programado, de acuerdo? Mm -hmm. And then you say, I'm going to have, I'm having a meeting tomorrow from eight to 11, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, excellent. So you see it is useful, the structure we are using. Congratulations and good luck again, okay? So uh, thank you for telling me about your day for tomorrow, William. Blanky, good evening, welcome. Brandon, hello, welcome. Thank you for being here. How was your day, Brandon? Everything okay at work? ¿Todo bien el trabajo? Yes, teacher, todo bien. Ok, great. Thank you. I'm happy for you. Hello, Miss Ivania. Good evening. Welcome. So happy that you are here. And the same for David Emanuel and Blanqui. Ok. Today is a Thursday and... Ok, one more day of classes. And Brandon, Juan Ezequiel, Blanqui, Ivania, William Francisco, and David Emanuel. Ok. Ok, good evening. Ok, we listen that your audio, Blanqui, is having kind of problems. Maybe you check the, the, the headphones or earphones. Or the microphone on the computer. Se le oye un poquito ahí con problema el audio, Blanqui. Tal vez si revisa el, el audífono, tenerlo un poco más cerca el, el micrófono. Ok, Miss Marlene Oneida, welcome. Sí, estoy, teacher. Me escucha. Sí, hoy se le oye un poco Good mejor. Evening. Good evening. Ok, so here we go. Hola. Hello, hola, oh, hola, sí. Blanqui. Hoy sí se le escucha mejor. Hoy sí. Okay, so you can have a better practice later on. And right now, class, we're going to get started because I was waiting for you. Did you have any problem logging into the, the class? ¿Se les presentó algún problema para ingresar a la clase? Como ayer, ya mejor, ya manejan mejor la situación. ¿Sí? No problem, teacher. Okay, great. Excellent. So let's get started. And here I'm going to share my PPT for you guys, okay, as every single day. And here we go. Today is October the 20th. Yes, the 20th day of October. And here we go with our agenda. Today is our video conference number 13. Our first activity as every single day is greetings. We're going to have a feedback. We're going to read the objectives. And our pre-task is to differentiate the WH words. Do you remember? WH question words. 
And as a preparation task, you're going to make WH questions in present progressive. And your task or assignment, your activity, okay, is to make WH questions in present progressive for today. And at the end, the wrapping up of the class. So class, I need one of you to help me reading the objectives for today's lesson, okay? One volunteer to read the objectives, please, if you are so nice. Mm -hmm. Only one. Hello, who's going to help me? Reading the objectives. Come on, you have to practice. Okay, David, thank you so much. Please go ahead. Okay, uh, a specific objective. Participant will be asked for a for and provide specific information about future, future even uh, at the workplace. Class objective. Participants will be able to ask questions about present continuous. Okay, thank you so much. Give me one second because I'm going to okay, I'm going to share with with Blanca Luz, no, Blanca Luz is here. Then it is Filomena, I think. Let me see if I send it to the correct chat, the link. Mm -hmm. Okay. So as David was reading class, you as participants will be ask for and provide the specific information about future events at the workplace. And you also will be able to ask questions about present continuous, okay? And again, a reminder for homeworks and evaluations, okay? Some of you are working very hard in the platform, but there are about two of you who are still owing me activities for week number two. Okay, so work on that, please, because remember that INSA4 checks that report, okay? And here, again, the requirements, check out that you have your full name in the camera if you used another link in order to log into the class, okay? And again, the attendance is mandatory if it is possible, okay, whenever you don't have any problem with the connectivity or with the power supply, power supply, el abastecimiento de energía eléctrica, we need to be here, okay? Two times the attendance will be taken and at the end, one of you is going to stay with me for about 10 minutes in the one-on-one -on -one session, okay? And here a reminder of the dates because we are in section number three, week number three. And here we go, okay? So class, as a feedback, if you remember class, we have been working with the subject, the auxiliary verb B in the ING form. This is the structure for the progressive or continuous form. Remember that we use am for I, is for he, she, it, are for you, we, and they. And here, for example, it, you only add ing, yes? And the same as learned, ing. But for study, you keep it like that and you add ien, yeah? So there is no problem. And read, reading, okay? Questions or comments about that structure? No? Okay. Here, we were working yesterday at the beginning, if you remember with this conversation, and I requested your participation. So right now I'm going to ask two of you in order to practice this conversation as a general feedback. Two participants, boys or girls, to read this conversation. Okay, thank you, Carlos Miguel. You're going to be Peter, and I need Henry. Who's going to help me reading Henry? Hello, is anybody here? Hello, hello, only David and the teacher. Everybody needs to practice. Why are you so shy? Are you having dinner? 
Okay, Carlos Miguel, I'm going to ask you to help me reading Henry, okay? So David, you read Peter, and Carlos, you read Henry, okay? Let's begin, please. Okay. <laughs> Hello, Henry. I have a question. Who is representing the company in the yearly conference? Hey, Peter. Well, Maria is... But Julie is attending uh, the conference this year too. So uh, I see, but if Julie is attending, who is delivering uh, the, the presentation for CEO next week? Uh, guess what? I am. I am, rep I am presenting with Hector, the new accountant. Uh, sounds great. So I am informing the committee, committee about it. Okay, thank you. I'm informing the committee about it. You had this practice and it was a reminder. And also yesterday, if you remember class, we were practicing how to use the simple present versus the present continuous, right? And here you have the two structures, some examples, and you were working in the completion of these sentences, right? And we shared as a class, and we made sure that all the answers were standardized. But also here you were writing in these boxes the activities that you usually do on a Monday morning at work, yeah? And you were sharing with your partners. And also here, you were practicing, speaking, asking and answering these two questions. Who is the first person to arrive at your workplace? And what is the first thing you do when you get to your workplace? You were personalizing these questions because you answered with your real information, right? And here we have this, okay? also this conversation. And I need two more students to participate reading this conversation. Two more participants. Okay. Since I don't have students volunteering, two more students. Let me see here. Ah, okay, Luz Filomena, thank God you're here. Okay, Jonathan, thank you. Brandon, okay. In many places it is raining. Okay, class, so maybe, let's see, maybe Jenny's Caroline and Anna Marlene. Marlene, are you available to read? Sí, teacher, ah. pero voy a poder participar okay. como una media hora, más o menos. Okay, okay. Pero aquí voy escuchando. Okay, thank you. So you're not available right now because you are on your way. So maybe Marlene, are you available? Marlene, está disponible. Hello, Marlene. No, she's not available at the moment. Estoy cenando, teacher. <laughs> eh, Nilton, are you available? Everybody having dinner, the teacher is not having dinner. No, hello. no, that's not okay. Okay, Nelton, you're going to practice with Jenny's Caroline, okay? Reading this conversation. Caroline, yes. Okay, here. Uh, Caroline, Jenny's Caroline, you're going to read Ryan. And Nilton, you're going to read Raul, okay? Let's begin, class. One, two, three. Jenny's. <laughs> Good afternoon, Milton. What are you doing right now? Good afternoon, Janice. I well, well, I am planning a video conference. Oh, the conference with the new things in San Salvador. What is our team doing right now? Yes, it is they are getting ready for the conference in meeting room. I see. What time do you usually get to your workplace? What's the first thing you do? I usually arrive at 6.30 am and the first things 
I do is check my emails and you? Well, all right, at seven o'clock or seven thirty. It depends on traffic. My first activity is to pick up the letters. Excellent, congratulations. Remember the pronunciation is arrive. Okay, arrive, usually arrive, usually get, are getting, doing right now, I'm planning, I am planning, what are you doing? And if you remember, you were answering these questions, okay? And we were discussing. But right now we're going to work at pages 35 and 36. That is the focus for today. And here we go, okay, class? Look at this. We're going to work on unit three and it is about it. Schedule events at the workplace. How to use present continuous with WH question words, okay? Let's remember that WH questions ask for specific information. We use the WH questions to ask for specific information, okay? When you demand information, where do you live? Okay, where do you work? Okay, what's your name? So specific information. The structure is WH word, plus the verb be, plus the subject, plus the verb must be in ing and the complement. The WH question words we're going to focus today is are what, when, where, why, which, who, how. Let's remember that who is used only to ask about information for people, okay? And here we have examples. Why is the meeting the new people? Uh, why is the meeting the new people today? Because blah, 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 and they give the reasons. Let's remember when we use the word why in a question, we always answer with because. The reason is because you are asking for a motive for a reason. And then when we use because, we justify the situation. When is the new office launching? It is launching on, okay? And the information on because it is about a date. When? When is the new office launching? It is launching on, and you use your imagination for the date. Where is your boss having the annual meeting? Okay, where about the place in, and you use your imagination. Now, what are you going to be doing right now? You are going to fill in the blanks using the words in parentheses. Example, in number one, what company are you working for? You work, what company are you working for? So it means that you are going to use the subject and the verb that is between parentheses in each of the sentences in order to complete them. But remember, you need to change the verb from the base form to ing form. Okay, is it clear the instruction? Está clara la instrucción. Yes. Okay, let's begin working on this. And while you are working on this, I'm going to call your names to take the first attendance. And for the people who are on the phone, I'm going to, okay, we're working this is at page 36 in your manual, but I'm going to, Okay, to share it with you via WhatsApp right now in case that you need it, okay? Veamos quién no puede ingresar. Ay, otra vez. Vamos a copiarle acá. Okay, begin working.
acá estoy, teacher. Buenas noches. Ah, ya está acá. Good evening. Okay, good evening. Okay, good evening. Ay, I was about to send you again the, the, the video so you can log in. Okay, thank you. Okay, Serafín, we are working on this activity. I don't know if you listen to the instructions. No sé si escuchó las instrucciones. Estamos trabajando en la página 36, okay? In the completion of these sentences from number two to number five, following the instructions, and we are using the subject that is given if between parentheses and the verb. But remember, the verb must be in ING, okay? And right now, class, um, while you are working on that activity, I'm going to take your attendance, okay? So, Serafin, yesterday there was a blackout in your house. Ayer hubo apagón ahí en su casa, Serafin, blackout, no power, no electricity, okay? On what we say. No, I don't listen to you, Serafine, because uh, the microphone is off. If you activate the sorry, microphone. Sorry. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, no. Se, es que llovió demasiado fuerte. Yeah. Uh -huh. Y toda la noche. Entonces, yeah. Almost. Se, un blackout. Agua... Blackout. You say together. Yes. Blackout, apagón. Okay. Blackout. Uh, uh -huh. Tonight. Uh, Y se, se restableció a las, como a las nueve, nueve cincuenta y dos. Ah, you should know, you should have logged in, okay? Entonces, Just to be here ten minutes or nine. Okay. okay, here we go, class. Thank you, Serafín, for being here. Ana Marlene. Marlene. Here I am, teacher. Thank you. Ana Verónica. Verónica. Great. Brandon. Present, Thank you. Carlos Miguel. I am here, teacher. Thank you. Carmen Guadalupe, are you Present. here? Okay, now you, you could make it. Thank you. Dani? Dani, I saw you here. Okay. David Emanuel. Present, teacher. Always here. Great. Uh, Edwin Roberto. Present teacher. Here, thank you. Ivania, here. Here I am. Great. Jenny's Caroline, over here. Present teacher. Thank you, Miss. Jonathan. Jonathan. Oh. Jonathan, your microphone. Okay, great. Jose Dimas. Hello, thank you. Jose Manuel. Jose Manuel, not here. Jose Mario. Jose Mario, not yet. Juan Ezequiel, always here. Where are you, Juan? Hello, hello. Okay, thank you. Marlene. Present teacher. Thank you, Miss Nilton. Present. Great. Serafin. Here I am, Miss. Thank you so much. William, always here. William Francisco. Present. Great. Present. Filomena Luz. Present teacher. After fighting with Zoom, después de estar luchando con Zoom, finally you're here, okay? Solo es a seguir el proceso, igual que ayer, okay, eh, Filomena? Okay. Okay, Blanqui. Present teacher. Thank you, Blanca Luz. Alejandra Michelle, are you here? No. Beatriz Noé. Mm -mm. Clelia, Miss Clelia. Present. Always here forever and ever. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, class, did you finish the completion of the sentences? Yes? Yes. Yes, okay. Let's see if we have the same. Okay, over here. The same answers. Here we go. 
In number two, following, okay? Following the correct order for the structure, how, okay, tell me, the completion is? How is dividing? Ah, uh, but the subject, how is he? How, how is he dividing the groups? Dividing the groups. Okay, notice this. Because the verb divide ends in E, we eliminate letter E and we add ING. Okay, notice that? Dividing. Now, when she hand the checks, the completion should be? Hello? It is handing. She. Okay. Handing. Is she? Is she handing? handing. Handing the check. Excellent. When is she handing the checks? Now, which factory this month your bus visit? The completion should be? Our bus visiting? Mm, because it is, is your bus. Yeah, is, that's is correct. Is your because is it is third person your singular. Excellent. Is your bus visiting? Okay. Is your bus visiting? Remember, it is not about you. It is not about me. It is about him. It is a he, your boss. Okay. It can be a she also, but also it is, is the third person singular, right? Now, why? Number five, the new secretary work the next Saturday. When? Is why? the Sorry. new secretary working? Excellent. Why is the new secretary, the new secretary um, working? Work. Okay. And then we have, why is the new secretary working the next Saturday? And I am expecting an answer, a reason, a motive. Okay. Estoy esperando la respuesta. Una justificación, una razón, un motivo. And when we ask why, the answer should begin with because. Okay. Porque. Now, class that we are here, I ask you, do you have any question about this structure? How to use present continuous with WH questions? If I say, Serafin, why were you absent yesterday in my class? I am asking for a reason for the motive of his absence. And he told me, because there was a blackout at home. And a heavy rain, porque hubo un apagón y lluvia fuerte. There was a blackout at home and a heavy rain, yeah? And he's giving me the reason, the motive why he was absent. Is that okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, no questions or comments about this? Okay, so let's move to our next activity class. And here we go. Hmm. Okay. Now, in the practice, what are you going on? Oh, now here. What are you going to be doing here in this practice? Letter A, B, and C. Let's pay attention to the instructions. Letter A, okay, let's see. Uh, Veronica, would you read letter A, instruction A? Excellent. You have to think of some future events of your classmates. And now letter B. Clelia, would you read letter B, instruction B? Write five questions to ask your classmates about those events. Excellent. So the first thing you have to do is to think 
of some future events of your classmates that you think your partners are going to have in their offices. After that, you're going to write five questions to ask your classmates about those events. And the last one, letter C, one, Juan Ezequiel, please read the instruction for letter C. Juan Ezequiel, are you here? Don't let me down. Juan Ezequiel is not here. Mm, so sad. Maybe Brandon, are you here, Brandon? Sorry, teacher. Sorry. They uh, okay, know <laughs> of their, their answer. Uh, uh, you have to write the answers that your partners are going to provide you. Okay. So here you have one, two, three, four, five spaces in order to write questions that you are going to ask to your partners. And here you write their answers. Okay. So I'm going to stop sharing this class. And we're here. Here it is. Okay. So I'm going to share this with you for your convenience because to edit it in WhatsApp sometimes it's easier to some of you. And here we go. Okay. Over here. Okay. There you are. Now I ask you, class, are the instructions clear about what you are going to do in this activity? Over here at page 36, think of some future events of your classmates, okay? Maybe, okay, uh, here. Let's imagine that I create one question. This is my imagination, but you use your imagination, your creativity, okay? If I ask you, for example, why are you working on November the 2nd? You know, who's going to work on November the second in this class? ¿Quién va a trabajar el 2 de noviembre? Me. Okay, so Ivania have... and Carlos. Do... Okay. No, no, no. Okay, so uh, let's imagine that I ask Ivania, Ivania, why are you working on November the second? And you tell me, because... Mm -hmm. <laughs> because... <laughs> My boss is my mother. Oh, <laughs> because my boss is my mother. My boss uh, asked me to, <laughs> to work on, on that day, for example. Yes, on that mm -hmm. day. Yeah. Porque mi jefe me pidió que trabajar ese día, okay? okay? Another possible, another possible answer for this question could be, y yo escribí lo que usted me dijo, sí. Entonces ustedes escriben las preguntas y van a escribir lo que sus compañeros o compañeras les van a contestar, sí, okay? Okay. And, and who is, who else is working on November the second? ¿Quién más trabajará el, el 2 de noviembre? Yo te ya. Me. Ana Marlene, why are you working on November the second? En realidad, en mi trabajo, los días feriados es cuando más se trabaja, como es de venta de comida a domicilio. Ah, okay. Oh, okay. Because it is an obligation to work that day. Because for me, it is an obligation to work that day. Yes. Y así cada quien va escribiendo la respuesta. But you have to think, okay, about the questions first. The questions can vary, okay? ¿Estamos claros? Sí, pero tienen que ser eh, respetando siempre la estructura, ¿verdad? El 
present continuous. For example, when are you, for example, taking vacations? Or how is, uh, let's see, how are you um, spending your next holiday? ¿Cómo vas a, a disfrutar tu próximo día feriado? ¿Ya? Yeah. Or when, eh, when are you taking your next vacations? Okay. And something like that. You use your imagination or uh, why are you printing those files? Okay. ¿Por qué estás imprimiendo esos archivos, esos documentos? And then you provide an answer. Okay. Use your imagination and creativity. But remember that the questions should be different. Recuerden que las preguntas tienen que ser diferentes, ¿verdad? Las la que cada quien va a generar, sí. No va a ser que van a crear cinco preguntas por equipo, ¿no? Okay, and right now I'm going to send you to the breakout room so you feel more comfortable and ask because sometimes here you are a little bit shy to ask me or ask your partners. And when we are in the breakout rooms, you feel more comfortable, more confident to ask. Okay, cuando estamos en los grupos, se siente como con más confianza para preguntar. If you have a doubt, let's verify. Hmm. How many students do I have? Uh, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, right now, listen, in each group, there are four students. Why? Because in case that someone has a problem with the connectivity, we're going to wait for them, yeah? But you continue working on that, okay? Si alguien tiene problemas con la conexión, tan pronto como se restablezca, inmediatamente es de regresar. Le estaremos esperando. If, in, if one day that happens to me, please wait for me, okay? Si algún día me pasa, please wait for me. Don't. Leave the room. No abandonen el salón. Here we go. Open your eyes and here's the invitation. Okay, I sent you the invitation. Please join your groups, guys. Join your groups. Okay, Serafin, we need you in group number four. Thank you. Blanky, we need you in group number five. And also Jonathan, we need you in group number five. And Juan Ezequiel, we need you in group number two. Jonathan, group number five is for you. And who else was in group number one? Okay, we're going to wait for you, Jonathan, in group number five. Okay, here we are. Um, listen, class, I'm going to tell you something. Jonathan is supposed to be working here with you, but I don't know if he is working or if he is having problems with the connectivity, okay? But go ahead. Yeah, try to build your questions and use your creativity, yeah? Okay. Okay. Or for example, why are you wearing, ah, quien, quien nos abandonó? Esta, ah, Blanky is back. Uh, if I say, um, Ivania, why are you wearing pink today? Uh -huh. Because. Because. Because celebrate Day of Cancer de Mama. Ah, yeah, the International Day yes. of, okay, the Mama, uh, Breast Cancer, Breast, ca breast Cancer, we say Breast Cancer. Okay. okay, yo he hecho estas, teacher. Okay, when, let me see. 
when are your holidays? But holidays son los días festivos. Son los public holidays. Serían okay. vacations. When are you taking? Porque ahí no llevamos el verbo eh, progressive. When are you taking, taking. Your, uh -huh, your vacations or your next vacations? Where are you celebrating the end of the year? Uh -huh. Where are you celebrating the, the end of the year? Acá una Y de más. Of the year party. What mm -hmm. are you doing for your vacation? Okay, excellent. Very well. That's it. Okay. Okay, similar like that. Okay, good. Okay. Use your creativity. Okay. okay. Or for example, when are you celebrating the company's anniversary? Yeah, another one. Okay. Use your imagination. Okay, bye. Bye, teacher. Very well done. Where will... Will... Okay. Bueno, yo puse will. You, you working... No, 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 no. Will no, porque no estamos usando en futuro. When ah, are you, okay. who, where are you working? Where are, are you? you? Uh -huh. Ajá, ah, recuerden okay. que es en progressive. Ok. okay. Voy a corregir aquí también. You... Ok, entonces sería, where are you working? Uh -huh. Working. Ok. Next week. Excellent, very well. That's it. And then mm. when you ask your partner, you mm -hmm. write his or her answer. That's it. Recuerden la estructura, sí. ¿verdad? Es usar el verbo to be y el verbo en ing, the complement and question mark, ¿ok? Ok, teacher. Ok, hey, bye. 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 Uy, me reñó la teacher. No, no, lo que pasa es que ay, me asusté a saber cuántas hicieron ya con Willy y es otra estructura. Ah, esa fue me va a regañar, no, dije yo, a mí, a mí me va a regañar esa fue. Ok, no, bye. Okay. Bye. Bye, bye. ok. Questions? No questions. Everything is clear. Teacher, yo estoy en blanco, no sé, no sé qué preguntar, no sé qué hacer. Use your imagination. If I ask you, when are you taking your next vacations? ¿Cuándo vas a tomar tus próximas vacaciones? Puede ser referente a cualquier cosa, teacher. Sí, pero del trabajo. Del trabajo, uh -huh. cabrón. Or, for example, when are you celebrating the, the employee's birthday in the company? Okay. ¿Cuándo celebran los, los cumpleaños de los empleados? When are you celebrating the employee's birthdays in the company? Y ahí le van a decir, at the beginning of the months, in the middle of the months, or at the end of the months, ya, yeah, al final okay. del mes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. When, ah, are you, so when are you taking your next vacations, ok? Ok. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Okay, or for example, where are you taking, where are you taking um, breakfast tomorrow? In my office, in the cafeteria at work, yes? Okay, yes. use your creativity. Okay, thank my, you. Yeah, my thank pleasure. You. Okay, questions? Comments? Is it clear? Estamos claras con las instrucciones. Hola. Somebody. Okay. Estamos bien con las instrucciones. Están construyendo las oraciones. O hay, o hay algo que le gustaría que les ayudara a clarificar. Pues por ahorita yo nada más quiero saber eh, la, 
nuestros compañeros nos tienen que decir los eventos, ¿verdad? De su trabajo. No, no, usted, y nosotros preguntar no, después. No, no, oh. no, no. Usted, oh. you think about, usted piensa, se imagina. For example, if I oh, okay. ask uh, Filomena, Filomena, when are you buying, when are you buying the supplies? Okay. And then she tells me, uh, I am buying the supplies tomorrow morning, for example. Or if I say, Filomena, where are you buying the, the food for the, for the employees, to tell you an example. And she says, uh, tomorrow in the afternoon, I am, okay, blah, 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 or I am buying the food for the employees tomorrow afternoon. Just an example, un ejemplo. Sí? Okay. okay. A teacher. Sí? Y de caso, digamos que si yo le quisiera preguntar, ¿cuándo es su próxima reunión? ¿Cómo es yes. el verbo? When, 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 are you when, having, when are you having your next meeting? When are you having your next meeting? When are you having your next vacation? Okay. When are you having your, the next uh, employee's birthday, birthday celebration? Y es correcto si la pregunta, how many reports do you make in a day? No. no. How many reports are you making tomorrow? Or how many um, reports are you making in a week or in a day? In are a you day. in mm -hmm. a day? How many reports are you making in a day? Porque acá no es con do you, sino que es información específica. Por eso es eh, un progresivo. Uh -huh. Are you making a, in a day? Haces a, al día o a diario. Ok. And maybe they are going to tell you, for example, if uh, I don't make any report. I don't make any report. I make zero report. Yes? Porque usted me está preguntando por la cantidad específica. Pero como yo no genero, de, eh, no escribo o redacto ningún reporte. Ok? And I can, or I can tell you two reports. Or I make, I am making two reports a day. Ok? Or daily. Okay. Uh -huh. Or when are you buying raw materials? ¿Cuándo vas a comprar materia prima? When are you buying raw materials? Mm. Next, I am buying raw material next week or next month or next Saturday. Yeah, you use your imagination also. También usen la imaginación para contestar, ¿de acuerdo? Okay. See you. In my house. Um. She. Are. Are doing. We are doing. She are doing. She are doing. She are doing. She are doing. She, are doing. <laughs> she, she is doing. <laughs> uh -huh. Sorry for doing. the interruption, but I had to. Lamento la She's interrupción, pero tenía que. Home. Thank you. Okay. Home work in she house. In she house. Oh. In her house. Ah, her. Yeah, possessive. Remember the possessives. Ah. Okay. Where are you taking classes today? Uh, every day uh, classes. No. Where are you? Where? Where, 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 place? Where uh -huh. are you where taking, are classes, you taking to, classes, classes today? today? Mm -hmm. 
¿Dónde estás tomando clases hoy? Where? I... I received, oh, perdon, I received a class in, in Chapor with the Amiga. Zoom meeting. <laughs> Zoom meeting. Uh -huh. She is taking in Zoom meeting. Okay, who is teaching you, you this morning? Who, who, who? who is teaching you this morning? ¿Quién te está dando clase este, este mes? Ya. Yeah. Yes. Mom, you, me, teacher, Irma. Okay, great. Okay, how much are you learning in class? Está aprendiendo bastante en la clase. Yes, I'm learning. I'm learning. I learned him uh, art English. Learning much. Okay. Where are they receiving English classes? Where are they receiving class English classes? Uh -huh. Otra vez, ¿dónde recibo? Hola. Hola. Hola, hola. Hola. Hola, Carlos, ¿me escucha? Sí, es que se escucha como cortado. Sí, es que no lo escucho bien tampoco. Yo no se escucho bien a los dos. Es que aquí está lloviendo bien fuerte. Ah, that is why, probably. Okay. Pero si lo uh, escucho bien a los dos, continúe. ¿Dónde está recibiendo las clases de inglés? Vale. ¿En su casa? I receive my English class in Freedom. ¿Dónde lo entendí? Freedom, o sea... At Regal International, the company <laughs> from English Corporativo. <laughs> <laughs> but to make it more interesting, Regal International. Mm -hmm. We're saving. Mm -hmm. We're saving. In English Corporation. Corporation. Y cuando es teacher, cuando es nombre propio, por ejemplo, inglés corporativo, así lo tendría que escribir. Yeah, inglés. because that is the name, uh -huh. yes. Ok. Ok. Ahora yo. How are you doing in English class? How are you doing? How are you doing in English class? How, How are you doing in the English class? ¿Cómo le va en la clase de inglés? ¿Cómo lo está haciendo? Um, I'm uh, doing, I'm doing. I, I'm doing very good. Okay. Es así. Sí, no sé, porque está bien recibido, pero lo poquito que lo van a entender ahorita. Empiezo okay. yo. Ok. La primera es... When are you celebrating your birthday? Okay. My birthday is March 11th. I'm celebrating my birthday on March 11th. 
I'm celebrating. Try, let's try to use the structure, okay? I'm celebrating my birthday on March 11th. Okay. I celebrate my birthday on March 11th. Excellent, very well. Continue. And the second question. Continue. Yes. yes. Why are you working the weekend? Who do you know? Who do you know in the English class? Who do you know in the English class? I can't. Uh, the question is, who do you know in the English class? Uh -huh. Who? Mm -hmm. Who do you? Who do know? you know in the English class? If you, if Veronica asked me, who do you know in the English class? I would say. I know Carlos Miguel, I know Serafín Constanza, I know Dani Alberto, I know Ana Veronica since uh, level one, and I know Edwin Roberto since level two. Yes? The question is correct, Veronica, but it doesn't apply to the structure. La pregunta está correcta pero no me utilizó la estructura porque el verbo no va en ING. Sí. Ah. For example, who are you knowing or meeting? Ok. Sí, sí. Uh -huh. Ok. Uh, I'm sorry for the interruption. Dani, hello, Dani, do you listen to me? Dani. Hello. Uh, your partners, do you remember your partners? Recuerda, no. su ¿Recuerda su compañero? ¿En cuál equipo estaba? ¿Con quién? No. Eh. Ay, que he estado fuera casi, casi todo, todo el, ¿verdad? El episodio. Sí. Ok, I'm going to leave you working here. Ok, so you listen what they are doing and then you can practice. Ok, continue. Ok. Sorry for the interruption. No. Ok, continue, Vero. No. Ya solo modifique la pregunta otra vez. <laughs> ah, ok. So you finished. Now the next participant. ¿Y los otros participantes? Pero aquí. Estamos en teacher presión, presión. Okay, Edwin and Serafin. Mr. Serafin. Okay, Mr. Constanza. Um, <laughs> quiero ver ahorita, quiero ser específico en lo que voy a decir. <laughs> Algo, oigo un poco mal porque está lloviendo acá también. Okay, okay, okay. Entonces, ahorita, ahorita. Eh, what salary are you getting? What, what salary are you getting or making? Meeting. Esa pregunta está eh, correcta, pero usualmente eh, la conocemos como ampolite question, como una pregunta no cortés, ¿por Entonces, qué? Porque es sobre uh -huh. salario, ¿ok? And then you say, you may say, ah, oh, I am making a good money or I am uh, getting a good salary, yeah. Sí, uh, but, uh, but you uh, said very um, specific, okay? Salary mínimo, 
Salary mínimo. Mínimo ah, salary. Uh, mínimo salary. Ok. I'm going to help you. He's going to tell you. I'm going to for, help for you example, to find another job, a better job, yeah, with a better salary. For example, yes, uh, the, the mínimo, ok, or a good salary. Yeah. Ok, listen, in English we have polite and unpolite questions. The unpolite questions, for example, uh, about the salary or about the age, how old are you? Yeah, those are unpolite because people feel kind of uncomfortable or embarrassed. La gente se siente como un poquito incómoda. Or if I ask you, uh, how much is your car? Yeah. A, a los americanos no, no, ellos lo toman como una pregunta descortés. There are many things that it is about uh -huh, culture. Maybe another thing that it is not part of our culture, algo más que no es parte de nuestra cultura, pero tal vez lo han visto en las películas. Cuando la gente ingresa a un elevator, ellos mm -hmm. no miran a los demás, ellos ingresan y van así, pero acá en nuestro país, Ok, absolutely different. Porque en, en, es parte de la cultura, sí. Ok, continue with me. Continue sí. with interviewing, Ajá. Serafín. And maybe one of you is going to interview later on, Danny. Ok, see you later. Bye. Sorry for the interruption. Okay. Sorry, Serafín. Ok, and here, ok. okay. Continue, please. Sorry, Serafín, sorry. Um, no, 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 continue, no. continue. No, I was no, clarifying no. because it is part of the culture. Yeah. The yo, les, yo les estaba, yo, ajá, ok, that's ok. Como le digo, la pregunta está correcta, pero por el aspecto cultural, ok. No, Bye. pero los suegros lo hacen, teacher. Oh, really, really. <laughs> well, Me pueden preguntar maybe... aquí los suegros. <laughs> oh, and everything is recorded. <laughs> ok, Bye. Okay. <laughs> they are not going to ask you only, no le van a preguntar seguramente eh, solo preguntar, they are going to ask you, show me your check yeah? cuando, cuando mi niña me, me presenta algún yerno lo voy a preguntar yeah. ok, that's a good idea bye, okay. continue please Here. Fíjense que la idea es que utilicemos las WH questions, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, acá. When are you visiting the clients in your work? When, cuando. When are you visiting clients in your work? Ok. El number three. When are you? Visiting clients in your work. When are you? When are you? Are you? When. Ajá. Y acá le hace falta el verbo tu bien, casi todas creo. When are you celebrating employees' birthdays? En la yeah. number one. When are you celebrating? Okay. When are you taking your vacation? Okay, that's it. Excellent. Remember the, the structure, okay? The WH question word, the verb to be, the subject, the verb in ING, and the complement. Okay? Y ya se hicieron okay. las preguntas oralmente. Sí. Hola. Ya se Gracias. hicieron las preguntas. Ya tuvieron la práctica oral. Ahorita continuo. Ok, let's do it, please. Recuerden que tienen que escribir la respuesta que su compañero les, les proporcione, ¿ok? Ok. okay. Uh -huh. no, no, when Hello. is you having? When is you having your Christmas? ¿Cuándo vas a tener tu Navidad? ¿Sí? ¿Esa era la pregunta o cuál era la pregunta acá? Oh. La fiesta, la fiesta navideña era. Ah, pero miren, de todos modos, is nunca se utiliza con you. When are you having your Christmas party at Ay. your work? Ah, that's okay. When are you having, are you, number four, are you, instead of is. When are you having your next 
meeting. When are you? Please don't let me down. Don't make me cry. <laughs> Al inicio está bien. Y acá les faltó el subject en la number one. Where are you uh, working next week? What is... <laughs> Solo una. Uh, bueno. <laughs> No, ahorita la en la sí, última ahorita. está bien. Number five is okay. What is your working schedule for November? Okay, está así porque se refiere a tu horario de trabajo. Horario de trabajo, si lo sustituimos por un pronombre personal, es it, ¿verdad? Okay. okay. De ahí la demás. Where are you working next week? When, eh, when are you in number two? When are you having your next vacation? Ok, teacher, pero no me deja editar, no sé por qué. Uh, bueno, uh -huh. yo sí la... Dale bien clic ahí para ver si te deja cambiar. Yo ya la cambié aquí en los míos. No, lo que sucede es que tiene que eh, hacerle en, eh, que cuál... Para editar, ¿cuál programa usó? No uso el que uso yo, el del PDF. No, lo que pasa es que estoy en la compu del trabajo y no he descargado el PDF. No, pero acá, ¿cómo lo edito? ¿Cómo, eh, cómo? Con Zoom hay una herramienta para anotar. Ah, oh, ok. But you mm -hmm. have to make the corrections, ok? Ok. And yeah, the, pero... the practice, the practice. Y ya hicieron okay, la práctica yes, oral. Yes, teacher. Ya tienen las respuestas de cada quien. Tenían que escribir las la respuestas de cada uno y las preguntas diferentes, ¿verdad? Cada quien tiene que generar sus preguntas diferentes. Yes, teacher. Mm -hmm. Yes. Did you, mm -hmm. did you interview Clelia? ¿Ya entrevistaron a Clelia? Eh, sí, pero es penosa. Pero ya le dio las respuestas. No, I don't think so. No. <laughs> pero sí ya tiene cada quien las respuestas de los compañeros. Yes? Yes, teacher. Ok. <laughs> try, to, try to correct the sentences, ok? See you. Okay. See you. See you. Finish the practice. Did you finish the practice, girls? And Francisco, William Francisco? Yes, Okay, and did you take notes of the answers your partners gave you? Tomaron nota de, de las respuestas de los compañeros? Yes? Filomena, did you ask your questions? Filomena ya hizo sus preguntas. Sí, ya la, ya la dije, ya tengo la respuesta también de la cuestión. Ok, muy bien. Y William también ya formuló sus preguntas de forma oral. ¿Quién es William? William, are you here? And Marlene also, también Marlene. Yes, teacher. Ok, great, excellent. And you wrote, you took note, ¿verdad? Y tomaron nota, ¿sí? Okay, so let's get back to the main session room so we can discuss, okay? Here we go. Uh, and Marlene is here too. Okay, excellent. Get ready with your questions, class. Okay. Here we go. Now that we're here, class, it is your turn to ask your questions to different people in the class, okay? 
but you don't have to ask the questions to the people, to the partners who were in your group. Is that okay? So I'm going to ask David Emanuel, choose one of your questions and ask one of your partners in the classroom. No comprendí, teacher. Yo hago la pregunta a yes. uno de mis compañeros de grupo. Yeah. No. No. People in this classroom. Okay. Forget about the people in your group. Porque ahí ya sabe las respuestas. Ah, Pero acá okay. vamos a saber las respuestas. Ok. Ok. Vamos a ver a, a Carlos. Ok, Carlos. Get ready. Hello. Carlos, where are you working next, next week? Where are you working next week? Where are you working next week? Um, ¿Dónde estaré trabajando la siguiente semana? Yes, ¿Sí? eso. Um, yes. I am I am working in my office. Okay, thank you. Next week, right now, Carlos, you. Ask one question to another partner. Okay, okay, okay. Vamos a ver. Dimas Barrera. Hello, Dimas. Hello, Carlos. Okay, how much are you learning in class? How much are you learning in class? Um, me no comprender <laughs> en español <laughs> en español estás aprendiendo en clase uh -huh. ajá uh, okay. um. <laughs> everything is recorded <laughs> todo queda grabado no <laughs> 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 broma <laughs> 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 Uh, very, 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 very much. Very, 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 very much. Okay, extremely. <laughs> so, uh, you, but you have to use the structure. I'm learning, okay? I'm learning. I'm learning. Very much. Okay. So, very, 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 much. very, okay. very, very, very much. <laughs> okay, now everything is recorded. Dimas, now you choose one of your questions and ask one of your partners. Okay. Um, ¿Dónde está mi víctima, joder? Ah, ya lo vi. Serafín. <laughs> okay, Serafín. Ask the question to Serafín. Okay. Serafín, when are, when, when are you celebrity employees' birthdays? Uh, repeat the question, please. When are when are you celebrating employees' birthday? When are you yes, celebrating? Yes. No. When when are when? you celebrating the employees' when? birthdays at work? When when are you uh, celebrating the employees' birthdays? At the work. Así, así como dijo la teacher. Uh -huh. <laughs> eh, no sé cómo responder ahí, teacher. Okay, what is the answer? I'm celebrating the employee's birthday. Uh -huh. ¿Cuándo celebran los cumpleaños en la compañía de los empleados? Uh, it's a um, celebrate it. Birthday is a uh, eh, como fin de mes. Okay, I'm, I'm celebrating the employees' birthdays at the end of the month. I'm celebrating the employees' birthdays at the at end the of the end month. Of the month. Okay. At the end of the month. Now, Serafin, you ask one question. Eh, eh. <laughs> Uh, Ivania. Yes. 
Uh, what level of English do you speak? I am speak uh, medium level. Medium level. Oh, great. Okay, the question <laughs> is okay, but I'm going to tell you something. Look at my screen, please. He asked okay. Serafin's question was this. What level of English? What level of English do you speak? Yes. Speak. Esta fue su pregunta, sí, Serafín. Así es. La pregunta está correcta, pero no es la estructura que estamos practicando en este momento, ¿sí o no? Okay. Ajá, porque no es con do you. Entonces tendría que ser what level Double. of English are you speaking? Yes, are you speaking? And then the answer, the potential answer could be, um, speaking intermediate level. For example, yes, I'm speaking intermediate level. Okay. But the question should be like this, because it is according to the structure that we are practicing, yeah? But this is not a future event. This is a, okay? So I repeat, don't confuse the present progressive with the present continuous for future events, okay? Thank you so much. Now, Ivania, it is your turn. Okay. Okay, for um, Milton. Okay. Milton, what are your outfits wearing to Halloween? Repeat, please. What are your outfits wearing to Halloween? What are you wearing, okay, as okay. outfit for Halloween? Okay. Teacher, es que no escucho bien, pero... Okay, uh, outfit for Halloween. Ah. Or, or, or these guys, these guys, these guys, okay, a disfraz. Okay. Okay, for Halloween, yours. Yeah. <laughs> what are you wearing for Halloween? Simple. Uh-huh. Escucho, pero sería como el disfraz de... Yes, la... yes, for Halloween. Ah, uh, my difference. My these guys. Ah, this guy uh, is. Ah, <laughs> uh, it the payaso it. I'm wearing the uh, the it clown. Okay. Okay, this guy's or outfit very well. Excellent. <laughs> now you, Nilton. <laughs> Ask one question. Um, okay. When are you having your next meeting? Uh, Jonathan. Jonathan, are you available? Jonathan, are you available? It seems that uh, Jonathan's microphone is open, but we don't listen to him. So ask the question to somebody else, Nilton, because maybe he's having problems with his audio. I sure. Okay, Nilton, ask the question to another classmate. Okay. The question goes to. Teacher, me desconecté un momento, pero no sé si Serafín ya pasó, si no a Serafín. No, sí, ya, ya le preguntaron ahí. Ah, ok, entonces. Dima le ah, preguntó. Ok, a Juan ya le preguntaron. No, también. no, Juan. Ok, entonces a Juan. Juan, Ezequiel, the question goes to you. Juan, 
When are you having your next meeting? Juan, when are you having your next meeting? <laughs> Use your imagination just to answer. I am on the... Uh, um, mm, sorry. <laughs> okay, that's okay. Excellent. But the only thing is, I'm having my next meeting on Monday. Okay. I'm having my next meeting on Monday. And that's okay. Because you never have a meeting, yeah? Okay, okay excellent. Juan, do you have a question for somebody in the class? Okay, uh, Blanca. Hi. Blanqui. Aquí estoy. Okay. Uh, what is what is your dream, Joe? Where? To what is your dream job? Repítame la otra vez que casi no le entiendo. He asked you, okay, what is your dream job? Repeat. I, I dream, um, I dream. Um, El trabajo de tus sueños, ¿cuál es? Ah, es que What yo pensé que drink job? de tomar, ya le iba no a decir. Dream. Dream, no dream, no drinking coffee, no dream, <laughs> dream job. Por eso es que ah, no entendía. No, yeah, <laughs> but it <laughs> makes a point because she was expecting something from work. What are you drinking at work, for example? I'm drinking coffee at work, yes. <laughs> but he asked you, what is your dream work or your dream job? Um, my dreams. My um, dream job is. Job is. How do I say? Gerente de planta. How do I? To be a floor manager. Floor manager. Okay, but listen. This situation again. The question is okay, but. He was not using the structure. That's why we are doing this practice, okay? What are you dreaming as your perfect job, for example? I'm dreaming of my perfect job as the uh, plant manager or floor manager or the company's manager. Yes? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Very well. And now, Blanky, you ask one question. <laughs> How oh, many people you may ask Ana Marlene, you may ask Carmen Guadalupe, Dani, you may Anna ask Marlene. William, Ana Veronica, Edwin, okay? Marlene. Uh, okay, Marlene. Hola. Okay, Blanqui has a question. Uh, how are you enjoying life? How are you enjoying life? I, I am, or oh, am. I'm enjoying en life. Enjoying my life. Past time with my family. Passing time with Passing my family. Passing time with, my, with family. my family. Excellent. Very well. Great. Marlene, ask one question to another partner. Ana Veronica. Okay, Vero. Veronica, Ana Veronica, get ready for the question. Marlene, ask the question. Okay. How many reports are you making a day, in a day? I make reports of Ana Veronica, now you ask the question to another partner. Filomena, 
Okay. okay. Uh, Filomena Luz, the question is for you. Okay. No, no la escuché. Say the question, Ana Verónica. Which fruit going pepper mango or okay. Who is going? Doing. Who is doing? You prefer mango or pepper? Did you get I it, people? Because I, 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 I. ¿Qué prefieres? ¿Qué, qué, qué estás prefiriendo? ¿Mango o fruto? No, no la entiendo. <laughs> I think there is a little problem with the audio, Vero. Would you say it again, please? What? Repeat the question, Veronica. Veronica nos repite la pregunta. How are you doing in English classes? Okay, great. How are you doing in English classes? Excellent. Filomena, did you listen? How are you doing in the English classes? ¿Cómo le ven las clases de inglés? I'm doing, I'm doing. I'm doing. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Oh, wow. Excellent. Because you, you know that everything is recorded. Okay. Excellent answer. I'm doing excellent. Thank you. Okay. We're going to stop this activity because you practice uh, a lot in your breakout rooms. But now we're going to move to the next activity. Okay. Because we need to continue practicing as much as possible. And here, okay, after having this, because it took a lot of time, but we needed to clarify, okay? And here class, again, a practice. Look at this, but pay close attention. Prestemos atención. Ask for and provide specific information about future events at the workplace. You have to ask and answer these two questions. What events are taking place at your workplace these days? Where are these events taking place and who is organizing them? Three questions actually, okay? What events are taking place at your workplace these days? Where are these events taking place and who is organizing them? Okay, do you have any problem with these questions? No? Are they clear? Están claras las preguntas? Yes, that is, okay, so this is what you are going to be asking and answering right now in the breakout rooms, depending on the company that you work for, okay? And I'm going to share this via WhatsApp too, so you can have it. And we move to the breakout rooms in order to practice speaking. Here we go, let me, I have one group of two, okay. I will have to move some, and I have one, two, three, and four, five in another group. Okay, I'm going to move one over here, let me see. Okay, here we go. I'm sending you the invitation class. Remember, speak. It is not that I'm going to ask the question and everybody's going to answer to me, no. I ask Ivania, Ivania asks Dimas, Dimas asks Veronica, Veronica asks me, okay? The idea is that all of you have the chance to practice the questions and the answers. Okay, go to your groups and there are three students that I'm going to assign in different groups. Bye-bye, go to your groups. I sent you the invitation.
Okay, for the people who had problems with the connectivity, I'm going to... Uh, yes. <laughs> okay, Janice, you were in group number five and Brandon was in group number one. And Nilton, your group, do you remember? Nilton, usted está en el equipo one. Okay, sorry. Janice... Okay, group number one. Okay, here we go. Great. So we have Seraphine. Ah, that's why we only have. Pero lo que sucede es que tengo dos participantes en el number one. Okay. Jonathan, we need you in your group, okay? Okay, here, okay, who organizes the events in the, it can be the communications department, yeah? Or marketing department or human resources department, or each department, yeah, or the manager, or the secretary, I don't know, Carmen Guadalupe is going to work with you also, okay? So you are Carmen, Dimas, and Juan Ezequiel, yeah? Okay. Okay. Recuerde que, uh, for example, the, the Christmas party is the, the most common nowadays, yeah? But in some companies, if you work in a call center, they they celebrate Halloween, yeah? Uh -huh. And uh, what is another one? Another Well, maybe the company's anniversary in some companies or the uh, employee's birthdays, yes? or any other celebration that you might have in there. Maybe the manager's uh, birthday. Okay, so. Okay. Okay, bye. Les pregunto a todos, para que así tengan las respuestas de todos los integrantes. Vale, uh -huh. Si quieres empecemos contigo, Nilton, entonces. O tú preguntas o yo pregunto, pero vos. Ok, si gusta yo pregunto entonces. Eh, ok, voy a ir. Dale, dale. Primero, Serafín. Ok. Ajá, pero hablando de estos días, pienso que atrás hoy también, día atrás hoy. And the following days, for example, uh, next month, November and December. For example, if you have a conference, if you have a meeting, meeting, yeah, because remember that we are using the ING form for planned events for the future. Para eventos que se han planificado para un futuro, ¿sí? Puede ser este fin de semana, mañana, la otra semana, el otro mes. Eh, by now, the most common activities that the companies are planning is the Christmas party, yeah, in the call centers, they celebrate Halloween. Yes. And maybe the company's anniversary, the manager's birthday. In el caso de... Perdón, Marlene, se le escucha bien suavecito. No sé si seré solo yo. En el caso de que cuando un, en el trabajo se le da la bienvenida a nuevos compañeros. Ah, the welcoming, okay. The welcoming for the new employees. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is the agenda, in the agenda, yeah, great. You can write a, a meeting, a conference, a training. If you have a training in your, in your schedule, in your agenda, yeah, for these days, or uh, planning the new strategy for the end of the year, okay? If you are in the sales department, ya entonces vienen las estrategias para fin de año, okay? Okay, use your imagination. Remember, depending on the 
on the company's nature, ¿ok? Uh -huh. Pero, ¿será, ne eh, ¿Será necesario mencionar la fecha? No, not necessary, only the months or in two weeks. Yeah. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. But if you want to mention the date, that's perfect, no problem, okay? But remember to use the structure. I'm having, for example, I'm having a training in two weeks. Yeah? Okay. okay. This event taking place um, Ya vamos a, ya vamos a, tranquilo. Este, este, este lo toqué ayer a Mastaída, este de loco. No, ya pues, vamos a poner ahí. Who is organ, organ, organizing? Who is organizing? Organizing. Ajá, who is organizing then? Eh, the managers is... Recursos humanos, como le dice. Human research. Human resources. I'm going to share it with Human you how resources. to spell it, okay? Human resources. Human resources. Human resources. Okay, over here. Human resources. Human resources. Human resources. Okay. 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 Blanca está por aquí. Blanqui, are you here, Miss Blanca Delgado? Miss Delgado, are you here? Yes, she is. Yes, yes. Blanca, what events are taking place at your workplace this day? In my work, I arise and being organized. ¿Qué se escuchó? Hello? Yeah, but, yeah, but repeat again. Say it again, please. Uh, in my world, mm -hmm. arise, rice is being organized. Se está organizando la carrera. Okay, in my company, uh-huh. In my we, I mean my company, we are uh, organizing a race. A race. A race. A race. Okay. It's kind of marathon, little marathon, yes? Sí, como pequeña yes. maratón. Okay. Excellent. Yes. Where are these events taking place? Where is this event taking place? Well, and the event taking place is in Santa Ana City. The event is taking place in Santa Ana City. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. And who is organizing then? Human Resources is organized. Is organizing it very well. Great. Okay. So you finished. No, yes. ni nadie me ha preguntado. Oh, bueno, me ha preguntado. very sad. Okay. <laughs> okay, Blanquie, <laughs> it is time of revenge. Both of them want to ask you. La dos le quiere preguntar. Okay. <laughs> See you, girls. Continue, bye. please. Okay, bye. <laughs> uh, where are there even taking place? In department design. Department? Design. Design. Okay, in? In the design, in the design department. Okay. Okay. And how is organized then? 
Department of Human Resources. Department of Human Resources. Human Resources Department. Um, okay. okay. Okay, thank you. Eh, falta, falta la de Nilton. Pero esa es alguien me las pregunta a mí. Vale, yo te las pregunto entonces. Vale. What que las haga me... Serafín, que las haga Serafín. Vaya, vale, Serafín, dale vos, pues. <risa> Serafín. Que cierra el micrófono, Dios. <risa> Serafín. <risa> no, Fincher, hombre. Póngale, pon... Vale, le punto le puse, a Serafín. Ya puse el, el micrófono, pero se me oyó. Excelente. Hoy ya, ya no se va a ir muy bien. Va. Vale, dale, pues. What's dale con... okay. What seven are taking place at your work place this day? Uh, uh, Turner the soccer. Um... We are these events taking place? Eh, is a chair. ¿Cómo sería campo de fútbol? En, o cancha de fútbol. Soccer field. Stadium. Soccer field. Or stadium. Soccer field. Uh -huh. Okay. Stadium. Soccer. soccer field. Soccer field. Okay. Eh, who is organizing thing? Eh, human Resource Department. Okay. Teacher. Tell me. Um, eh, ¿Cómo sería la pronunciación de, de cuando dice taking? Taking, así, taking. Taking. Taking, 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 taking yes. Taking. Y, this day, this day. These ahí. days, these days, these days, these esos days. días, these days. These days, these days, these days, estos días. These events taking place. Ah, uh -huh. days. Y el, la última, who is organizing. Así. Who is organizing them? ¿Quién los está organizando? Oh, ¿Qué cosa who los is. eventos? Who, quién? Who is organizing them? Who is organizing them? Yes. Okay. Thank you, Miss. Okay, my pleasure. Finished. Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay, great. Excellent. Congratulations. And okay, when I arrived, Miss Clelia was answering, right? Clelia estaba contestando cuando llegué, sí? Sí. Okay, great. So everybody had the practice to ask and answer. Yes. ¿Todos practicaron preguntar y responder? Yes. Ok, Serafín, I know you don't lie to me. Ya sé que Serafín no me miente. Yeah, she says, <laughs> he says yes, yes, of course. Ok, so class, let's get back to the main session room. Ok, here okay. we go. Thank you for your practice. You practice actively. Thank you, teacher. Ok. okay. I need you to activate your cameras because I'm going to take the second attendance when everybody gets back. And later we go to another practice. And let me tell you, congratulations class, you're doing an excellent job, most of you in the platform because some of you are okay working in week number three and in week number four and some others are done with week number four, yeah. So congratulations on your performance and keep on working because remember, I tell you always with the problems with the connectivity uh, and also with the blackouts because of the rain. So you better work slowly and calm. So here we go. I think that everybody's back. Yeah, let me double check. Yes, everybody's back. So here I'm going to say your names again. Ana Marlene. Marlene. Present teacher. 
Thank you. Miss Ana Veronica. Present. Thank you, Brandon. Present. Yes. Thank you, Brandon. Carlos Miguel. Where are you, Carlos? Carlos I Miguel. Am here. Always yes. here. Thank you. Carmen Guadalupe. Carmen, Miss yes. Carmen. Thank you, Miss Carmen. Clelia, Miss Clelia. Yes. Thank you, Miss Clelia. Stay yesterday with me, right, Clelia? Yes. Yeah, she stayed with me. Danny, are you here, thank Danny? You. Okay, thank you. Um, David Emanuel. Present, present teacher. Thank you, sir. Edwin, are you here, Edwin? I don't see you. Ed okay. Okay, thank you, sir. Ivania. Here I am. Great. Lady in pink. Janice Caroline. Present teacher. Thank you, Miss Janice. Jonathan. Jose Dimas. Present. Great. Jose Manuel absent today. Jose Mario absent today. Jose and Jose absent today. Juan Ezequiel. Present teacher. Thank you so much, sir. Marlene Oneida. Present teacher. Great. Nilton. Present. Thank you, Serafin. Hi. Present. Hi, thank you. Present. William. William Francisco. William Francisco. What happened to William Francisco? He lost the connectivity because he's always here. Okay, uh, Filomena Luz. Present. Thank you, Miss Blanca Luz Delgado. Present. Thank you, Miss Alejandra Michel. Absent today. Beatriz, absent today. Noé, absent today. So, did I color your names? Yes, a nadie deje fuera. Okay, class, now what are you going to continue working with? Okay, so here we go. Okay, this one. This is what you were practicing, right? And now, here we go with this, another practice between Rita and Luis. Listen to your teacher, read the conversation, then practice with a partner. Luis? Good afternoon. This is Rita, the new secretary. I just want to confirm some information. Hey, Rita, sure, tell me. I want to know who are attending the annual conference this year and where is it taking place? Well, the IT staff is attending and the conference is taking place in the great room, Rita. By the way, when are the materials arriving? Do you know? Got it. They are arriving on Friday morning. Okay, so we're going to read this conversation. You switch roles and you replace these names. Luis. And Rita, for example, uh, Filomena, good afternoon. This is Irma, the new secretary. I just want to confirm some information. And then she answers, hey, Irma, sure, tell me. Then I tell her, I want to know who are attending the annual conference this year and where is it taking place? Well. The IT staff is attending and the conference is taking place in the great room, uh, Irma. By the way, when are the materials arriving? Do you know? Got it. They are arriving on Friday morning. Okay. So first you read it as it is and later you replace it these names by your names. That's the only thing you have to do. And after that, we're going to complete the questions by using this conversation to help yourself, okay? In order to use the WH questions over here. Is it clear? Yes. What you're going to do, yes? 
Okay, and right now for the ones who need it, I'm going to share the conversation, okay, via WhatsApp, in case that you need it. Here we go. Okay, there you are. And now uh, that is at page 35, okay? So let's move to the breakout rooms and let me see. Okay, one, two, three, four, no. No, I'm going to move one of you. I don't know who to move. Okay, time is almost over. Go take turns and practice as much as possible right now, okay? Open your eyes because the invitation was sent. Go to your groups, please. Let's move, let's move and practice the conversation. Bye, go to your groups and practice the conversation. Okay, go to your go to your groups one and blanky blanca go to your group blanca delgado your group is number five join them please they are waiting for you 